Hi, I am glad to introduce a brief overview of my lecture to you. This course is Understanding of LEDs. I am Professor Tong Sun Lee in School of Electrical Engineering and Computer Science. I am going to show you briefly what this course is about. First of all, LED stands for Light Emitting Diode. Now you can see LEDs everywhere in many many applications with beautiful colors, especially indoor and outdoor lighting applications. The first LED was made more than 100 years ago. The first semi, uh, semiconductor based modern type LED was red and it was invented about 60 years ago and then green was developed but they were very dim and used only for indicators but mid 1990s blue led was developed and its brightness was improved significantly in a very short time and later white led was possible and even brighter than conventional illuminations such as fluorescent lamps so now you can easily buy LED lamps at any market. Very recently, LEDs are now being developed to make displays. Not LED TV as you know, where LEDs are used only for backlighting, but micro LEDs are used as each real pixels. In a very short time, you can buy TVs and smart glasses consisting of micro LEDs. As already mentioned, after the blue LED and the white LED had been developed, their efficiency improved a lot. Efficiency became greater than the conventional illumination system. The world has witnessed that blue LED is a new energy efficient and environment friendly light source and white LED lamps are more long lasting and more efficient alternative to all the light sources. For this contribution, Professor Isamu Akasaki, Hiroshi Amano, and Shuji Nakamura got Nobel Prize in Physics in year 2014. Left picture shows very basic principle of LED lighting. Right picture shows how to make white light. When you put yellow phosphor on a blue LED, you can get white light by mixing of blue and yellow. I will not explain in detail here, but you can learn more in the class. Here is what I give lecture during the class, which include basic principle of LED operation, optical and electrical properties, several important definitions such as efficiency. I will also lecture on how to fabricate and evaluate LEDs and most up-to-date micro LEDs. After taking this course, I'm sure you can understand what LED is. These are textbooks and references for the class, but all the lecture materials will be given in advance. I hope you find interest in LEDs and get understanding through this class. Thank you.